Hello everybody, hope you're having a fantastic day. For today's message, I'm going to be looking at the Divine Masculine Twin Flame Energies. And if you would like a personal reading or Twin Flame Coaching, please check the description box below. Give thanks for your connection with your Divine Partner. Yeah, be in a state of appreciation. And then you attract more things to appreciate. There's a communication coming, but all I'll be showing you there is how your relationship is with love, so it's okay to burst into tears in front of me. It's not about how you look, you don't have to be dressed up. It don't matter what anyone's saying in the moment, it's just an exchange of emotion, and I'm testing the waters. Um finding out is she still here does it matter if we speak regularly or not doesn't matter if there's any physical distance or not no it doesn't matter it's still there it won't change it's eternal it's ever loving and there's outcomes coming there's stuff that's Coming to fruition, coming to its logical conclusion. They'll be seeing in you, seeing new perspectives, the higher perspective, enlightenment, illumination, renewal, new direction. What do I want here? It's time, taking charge, a new way of thinking, completions, beginnings. If, uh, uh, and I assure you that we do belong together. We're going to be mixing business and pleasure and love. It's about being connected not only to your inner voice, but also whatever kind of power of being or idea you have that's greater than yourself. This card is frequently defined as the core, meaning you'll receive clarity about some larger task your soul wants to make. That urge you're feeling, that big wonderful thing you're thinking of doing, do it. Don't question it, because you know you know. It comes from the bestest, purest part of yourself. But the main message here is that results are being predicted. You're about to get an outcome in any situation, be it career, love or relationships. If you're uncertain about your future, you'll soon get the answers which you are so desperately seeking. Love, relationships, futures, romances, outcomes, exes, feelings, intentions, reconciliations, marriage, pregnancies, positives, negatives and more. Life-changing opportunities and callings are being predicted. Significant life-changing events are about to take place. A transition from one state from another. Relationships can go from dating to marriage or dating to breakups. Jobs can go to promotions or sackings or redundancies. This is a time when all the efforts you've put in will result in one thing or another. A life-changing opportunity. Decisions around this opportunity will need to be made swiftly because there may be a time limit. The choices you make during this time period will affect your, the rest of your life or even the whole of eternity, so they're not to be taken lightly. Creative inspiration. So you're being asked here to tap into your creativity, express from your sacral because expressing your creative energy is also creating your sexual energy and I like that that's very magnetic to me I'm all over that so keep doing that I am authentic unique and wondrously made I honor myself flaws and all loving myself unconditionally it's, it's the flaws that make you so attractive to your twin flame don't you find my flaws so incredibly endearing as well. Just be yourself, that's all you have to do. If there is a communication or an encounter, all you have to do is be you. And it's okay to be nervous. It's okay to not be as cool as you'd like to be. It's all okay. It, you, Who you are is who I want. Who you are is who I love. Mm. 
hidden knowledge. Yeah, it's been a recurring theme in today's readings about intuition. The moon card came out in the previous reading and this card is connected to the moon. The final truth is coming to light, come out of a situation, total understanding, instant manifestation. You will get solutions, clarity, wisdom and knowledge. The situation may feel uncertain because what's important lies below the surface and doesn't necessarily feel, seem logical. There are secrets of thought muddying the waters and only those well versed in the rhythms of the universe will see what's really going on. One reason to work on understanding your inner life and being able to hear your inner voice is for times like these. The external situation isn't making much sense. Like I'm going through my own process and it won't look like it's making sense from where you're standing, but that's okay. Circumstances won't help you decide what to do. Tap into your inner wisdom for your truest guidance in this case. You will get solutions, clarity, wisdom and knowledge. You'll be able to see and understand it now. Be really confident. You're keeping your cards to your chest up to a greater or lesser extent as well. You're doing your own thing in a state of calm and trust that something's hidden. You're not revealing all right now and that's making me more obsessed. I need to know. You're going to earn your spot no matter how badly anybody else wants me. Alchemy. You put a spell on me. I'm yours. Transmutation. You have the key to my heart. You have your way in. You're the keeper of hidden secrets. Everything is going to be revealed. The, the final truth is being revealed. We'll be coming out of, the situa of a situation with total understanding. Instant manifestation, you'll get solutions. Clarity, wisdom, knowledge, able to see and understand it now. Be really confident. The mysteries of the universe are hidden, but we will be brought out into the open very soon. Work on your inner life so you can hear your inner voice. Relating to the moon, this also represents what needs to be revealed. You're not meant to know what's happening in the future. That's God's, so don't worry about it. What is for you will not pass you. You have to use your intuition to direct you towards the answers. And nurture that psychic connection that we have. Inner child. So there's a lot of inner child healing going on because this area is where the root of many of the patterns are that may be holding an undesirable external situation in place at this time. And that's okay. Perhaps this is where our patterns of settling for, for less have come from. Looking outside for love or a codependent dynamic and it's nobody's fault. These patterns have probably been there for lifetimes. So follow, it's just about following the feeling and unraveling the core reason where the patterns is, pattern is there. You already know it won't be something new. Just look at what the pattern hold, what the pattern is and what pattern holds the situation there and how you feel about it and trying to get rid of it. Just dissolve it piece by piece, week by week. Focus on your soul mission. So it's a little bit here about life purpose because we're going to be doing our life purpose together. Our union needs a really strong foundation. So just take time to really love this area of your life. Put love in, put love energy in and really ground into the new vibration as it raises higher and higher. Now, this could be a special message for somebody who's an air sign, or you could be dealing with an air sign here. But balance is being brought back into the relationship. Need a, we need a new set of terms. It's well thought out. 
and there's a new discussion coming there is a way and we can go for it it started out as an initial idea and maybe there was something very childlike about that but it's okay to be childlike because children have vast imaginations uh, they believe in something they believe in their dreams so act from your truth here you could be dealing with an Aquarius spark of a good idea will it work eyes of wonder eyes of wonderment open to possibilities no limitations possible communication coming in being open to your truth being open to saying your truth having your head screwed you've got your head screwed on right now you're following your true direction and your inspiration this is a brand new endeavor the seeds are just sprouting you can see the first green shoots of recovery but the acorn will become a tree it's on its way this is very pos promising and positive effective communication coming thoughts are going to land energy passion enthusiasm you're bursting with new ideas and plans for the future you may be excited about starting a new project pursuing a new approach or learning something new you have so much energy you feel like you can do almost anything and you can the challenge however is whether you keep it up so you follow through with this energy as you ride this wave of energy and keep up the pace you may be exploring a new way of thinking i know i am a new idea a new perspective new knowledge or a new technique we both have curious minds and a thirst for knowledge as you explore this fresh way of thinking you are asking lots of questions and gathering as much information as possible okay everybody i'm going to end this message here i really hope that you enjoyed it and i hope you enjoy the rest of your day and i will see you in the next video bye bye